a few things to make sure everybody's on board and they know how to navigate through all the materials in the class. So let's see how we get started, okay? Come over here under Course Home Page and click the button Start Course, which will carry you to My Course Content, which you could also come here as well and click. Okay. Under this area, you'll see a, a list over here on the left with general course information, assignments, and what we're going to be doing week by week in the course. So the first thing we want to do is open up the general course information. Hopefully by now everybody has read this, but I'm coming here making sure everybody's on the same page for what we're doing, okay? So general course information. You see where my office is located, so if you're on campus and want to come by and visit me, that would be great. You've got my email, the textbook, biology concepts and connections, there's the ISBN number, and your textbook website is masteringbiology.com. So I've got lots of information here um, for you to look through when you're, let me just scroll down here, when you register for Mastering Biology, this is the course ID number that they're going to be asking for in your registration. They'll ask, did your instructor supply you with a course ID? So it's Bio 101 2013F, okay? Everyone should register in Mastering Biology and begin their coursework no later than Saturday, this Saturday, August 17th at 11 p.m. If you are having any trouble, please contact me. All right, ASAP, make sure we can get you into the system. Your assignments for week one are going to be due on Sunday, so this Sunday, August 18th, is when chapter one assignments, homework, and your quizzes through Master in Biology are going to be due, okay? Also, computer requirements, Adobe Flash Player, after you've logged into Master in Biology, you need to make sure that you have um, your internet is going to be able to support what we're doing in Master in Biology. Okay, having a good computer is essential for taking an internet course. All right, attendance, y'all got to make sure that you're submitting all of your homeworks. Failure to submit three homework assignments and or quizzes will result in an administrative withdrawal from the course. Make sure that you stay on top of your work week by week. No late submissions will be accepted. It's your responsibility. Guys, this is a job. You show up for work. Okay? Grading, you'll see, we'll have four major tests, 60% of your grade. Chapter homework through Mastering Biology is 5% of your grade. Chapter quizzes through Mastering Biology, 5% of your grade. The message board, many of you have already submitted in the topics area of message board. That's 5% of your grade. Lab topics, I'm going to get into lab topics a little bit more in depth in a few minutes. That's 10% of your grade. Yes, they are virtual. Okay? And then at the end of the semester, it'll come quick. Final exam, 15% of your grade. Okay? Please be checking the announcements in Campus Cruiser within our course, you know, every few days to make sure I haven't um, put something up that's going to affect you, so make sure you check in, okay? I will post your grades. I will transfer the grades that you earn in Master in Biology, and I will, will import and they will be recorded in my grades in Campus Cruiser. So that's where you'll be seeing your grades load up in Campus Cruiser. Check under my grades, okay? When you take tests, they are administered through my assessments in Campus Cruiser. So when you come in to Cruiser, okay, under this area it says my assessments that's where you'll go to take your tests, okay? And it's not loaded as of yet because it's I haven't uh, made it available 
it's in a few weeks that test one will be made available when this is highlighted and you're able to click on it that's when it's available to take okay remember September 1st it'll be opened up a couple of days before so you'll have a little while to be able to take it okay I'm going to come back to my course content here into general course information where we were Let's see if it'll load it back up all right so that's where you'll take your test I've got more information on your cha chapter homework and quizzes on your message board the lab topic area is what I want to cover next and you will see over here the lab topics for the first part of the semester is going to be assigned through the area of process of science in your mastering biology okay so let's go there right now and if you don't follow here or if you want to come back um, I have a tutorial on the process of science navigation but I'm going to do it for you here okay where you want to go is into mastering biology so by this point you should have registered and I'm going to log myself in and I'm wanting to go to lab topic one under the process of science okay here is my study area this is where you will find lab topic number one that's due Sunday August 18th I'm under chapter one come down to chapter guide look down under extend your knowledge here is the process of science how does acid precipitation affect trees click in there open it up it's a lot of like your mastering biology work where you'll be moving through activities reading about acid precipitation here and then it tells you click on the questions window and answer question one so here you're actually going to be interpreting data through some of these you know answering your questions along and along so you know be, be active in your learning here and as you move through the activity it will tell you when to go down and answer more of your questions okay so as you work through it y'all will do that and submit your work and so 10 questions there once you've completed it and you're satisfied with your answers you would like to submit answers for grading and it'll show up here and you can print this page so you can hold on to it and have a copy for yourself and what else you can do when you submit make sure you type in your name I want your name please email it to yourself so I'd email this to myself so if I was one of y'all and I'm going to also email it to the instructor which is me right so once you filled in your addresses where you want it emailed then you email the results okay you see I didn't enter my name so you've got to make sure you enter your name and now it's gonna submit it to me so when I go to my email I'm gonna see results for my first lab topic you have sent it to yourself and you will send it to me I will grade it and in about a week you'll see a, a grade up in campus cruiser for it and I'll be emailing some answers out to everyone so you can see maybe um, where you went wrong or where you could have done a little bit better alright so that's how you get into the lab topics for right now is the process of science area remember let's let's back up and and see where we went here remember you came into mastering biology study area click on study area and utilize this area for other things as well there's a lot of study 
word study tools and things like that in here. Take advantage of this. Really work your way through here. They're really, really good. Okay? Come back to chapter guide. Where do I go? Scroll down to extend your knowledge, process of science. And this was the one that was in your assignments that you needed to go through, submit your answers. And you've done your first lab. Very good. Alright, let me come back here to my course content. You see week by week it will show you what we're doing. Right? So first week we're reading chapter one. I'm going to have loaded up for each chapter, chapter notes. I've already pulled that off. So make sure you pull your chapter notes notes off. Let me pull that off again. Closed it. Right? So chapter one. So this is great for study. Okay? So I have those up for you. I also have up, let's get back to week one, the PowerPoints lectures that you can work through. And so they're very good. They follow, you know, information that will be covered in the book. So it kind of lays it out a little bit more um, specifically like you to read but this is just kind of more of a study guide on each section of 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 each chapter so chapter one biology exploring life and then you will go into mastering biology working through your activities your word study activities you know your terms and all and those should really reinforce the concepts in all of your chapters and then along with those taking your quizzes Okay, so going here to Master in Biology, we can see that. Let's make sure, you know, chapters, let me make sure I'm in y'all's course here. We've got to get into the exact one for y'all. And this is, I'm also teaching a, a course that's face-to-face -face in Biology 101. So I need to make sure I'm in y'all's course here. And here we go. Alright, so there is an introduction where you can come in and learn the ins and outs of how Master in Biology works. Okay? And so here's your Chapter 1 homework. I'll come into Student View. So coming in, it's, it's, it's pretty fun to do this work. You're watching animations, and it's reinforcing the, ma the material that we're doing in each chapter. So it's, it's a great learning activity. I really, really like this. So do your best in these because it is a part of your grade. And then when you get ready to study for your test, you can come back here and, and uh, check them out again. Okay? All right, let me come back here to Course Home. And then also you have quizzes for each chapter that will come up. And you'll want to work through all of your quizzes, okay? So you continue to, to each question, do your very best. Remember, it is graded. And you can come back here and, and study again as well for your test. So, Master in Biology is going to be very important in your progression through the material this semester in Bio 101 Internet. Okay? Alright. Let's come back here to my course content. Here in the Assignments area, there is also a Word document that you can print out that week by week so you can have a hard copy and keep up with it so week by week it's telling you what is due your message boards we need to come in here let's check out the message boards okay there's your message board for this course a lot of you have already submitted so message board one wanted you to come in and tell me what you think about biology around you in your everyday life. So look, a lot of you have already submitted, and this is wonderful. Once you submit your 
your response to a, a message board, then I want you to go, go in and check out everybody's and read what they have to say and maybe you find one that's very interesting to you and you respond to them, right? So let's this, we're making this a community learning environment so you know we can kind of learn about each other. So this is a wonderful way, even though we're not meeting face to face, we can get to know some of the people in our class, okay? So I'm gonna come back here to my course content. Remember in your assignments, I can tell week by week when things are due. So coming in here, I've got my assignments and Master in Biology that I see when they're due. I also have my lab topic, my process of science. I've gotta go in there and when that's due, right? This Sunday, gotta go in there and do those. And remember to check out your message boards every week, which they won't be every week, but there'll be about five of them, so make sure you're on top of when those are up. And some of them are up and y'all have already posted, and that's fine if y'all want to work ahead in that area. That's fine. So, but your original post is due by 8.15, and then your response to your classmates due by Sunday, okay? And then things will open up for the next weeks. And then you'll see test one, Sunday, September 1st. Okay, that's when your first test, you've got to have it submitted. Remember where you're going? My assessments. And it'll be available for you by Thursday, August 29th. So if you're ready to take it then, that's fine. But you have until Sunday. Please make sure you're, you're looking ahead and making sure that you're submitting everything. Please contact me by email and say, Ms. Plummer, have I, have I submitted everything? Am I, am, I, am I where I'm supposed to be? Don't get behind. Very good. So want everybody to be working very hard. I'm here for you. Don't hesitate to contact me. Make sure you're checking in a couple of times a week to make sure I haven't left any more announcements for you. All right. Y'all do well. See you soon.